how to download um, multiple files from Coursera or from the Jupyter Notebook. Uh, so first you go to this terminal and when you input the PWD it will show you where you are right now in terms of current directory and one thing uh, tricky is that if you put ls it shows you there is no files and what I did was kind of I navigate one directory above and right now I'm at home list um, the only thing I have is this work directory so I go one more uh, directory above and then when you list the content you see a bunch of all this stuff and it's kind of tricky that the material itself is located in this TF folder for my specific course um, so for yours it might be a different name you need to um, you know try it out by yourself but let's navigate to TF um, and if we list the content we see the uh, folder W2A1 with the week 2 uh, assignment 1 shows up and at this moment you know you can follow some normal uh, instruction online which um, helps to uh, actually download the uh, help, help to create a zip folder with all the content um, and at this moment you know you can uh, delete previous uh, zip but right now I don't have previous zip so I can directly using this command here um, as let's say tar uh, dash CZF and then um, this is this means your current directory which is in my case is TF so I want to get a zip named W2A1 uh, dot J R uh, not sure if it's J R or not uh, let's say T A R G Z tar.gz and then uh, using uh, the current directory and uh, w2a1 this folder so when I do this it will create um, this zipped file for me and if I go back to uh, you know my home um, this is the notebook but uh, uh, if you go back to the directory here you will see this w2a1 shows up and then you can uh, you know download this thing to your computer and this is the uh, you know zip fo zipped folder if you go to here uh, and then if you just uh, uh, one thing you could do is to just open it I guess uh, okay you need a zip uh, tour but this one what I usually do is I would just uh, um, do something like that and then this tar file um, can be further unzipped So this contains all the content that is located inside um, this folder. Okay, that's kind of the tutorial. Thank you.